it's nice obviously to get a couple tries but ultimately the win's what we want um, it wasn't enough today uh, we spoke about our, obviously our mindset in that first half I think uh, everyone to a man was not at the races we weren't at the level we needed to be um, to win obviously put ourselves in a position to win it but we can't you know we can't keep doing that as a squad it's a matter of too little too too little too late um, you know we, we obviously spoke about defence in the week and that again wasn't good enough along with our discipline so you know we've got a week off now but a long hard look at ourselves going into I think it's Bath at home the next game and hopefully we can rectify those issues because you know a few boys will I'm sure have tough conversations I think as a squad we just had a good conversation there um, and we know we know what we need to to win games and you know we can't be we can't be off it but you know this is a good one to learn from because we still still got two points from it still got a bonus two bonus points so you know we're still in a good position in the league but if we want to win this league we can't be we can't be like that my job's to finish and if that's five meters out through a couple of blokes then i've got to do that um and it helps obviously i'm on the bigger side for wingers so that that helps having a bit more weight behind me but yeah <laughs> Not every try can be a worldie, so if a collective a collective distance of 10 metres for two scores, I'm happy with that. It's, it's probably going to be quite strange. You've got, got used to kind of the eerie silence that you get in these games, but can't can't wait. You know, it's been blooming, what, 10 months? I think I think our last game with fans was Bath, so hopefully we can hopefully we can actually make a change and win this one because I know we didn't we didn't perform well last time, so hopefully we can make the changes needed, uh, implement the learnings from this game and get the win.